Hey family, don't mind Miss Kitty over here. <laughs> okay, so welcome back to D Love Journey. If you're new here, my name is Ty Deja, but you can call me Deja. And this channel is all about mind, body, spirit. Our community guidelines are very simple. Know thyself, love thyself, be thyself. So if that's something you can get down with, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, join our community. We'd love to have you. Of course, today we are journeying into something that's all about body, body wellness. And so I'm going to be doing a quick review on this peculiar, pe peculiar people <laughs> detox that I took. If you're interested in how that went, it's a holistic cleanse, gentle. It is for the um, lung, colon, liver, and kidney. And it's a full flush. And honey, did it flush. Okay. I lost six pounds doing this cleanse, 24 hours. Um, so if you wanna know all about it, stay tuned, we'll get right into it. Those of you who have Instagram, I'm sure you've seen this before. The Peculiar People, Peculiar People Holistic uh, Happy Colon Cleanser. Now, a lot of celebrities have been like doing little videos about this. I've seen a lot of the spiritual community, people who are doing detoxes show this. So of course, you know, it's all up in the algorithm. I have been a little skeptical for a while, but I wanted to try it. It's a complete lung, colon, liver, and kidney flush. So I definitely want to go ahead and give you guys a quick breakdown because, honey, yes, it definitely did flush me out. So I'll be inserting a couple of videos of when I actually took the detox and my experience um, after maybe bowel movement number four or five. I was so exhausted. I'm not sure if I filmed much after that. But I will say I did lose six pounds in 24 hours with this. Obviously, weight loss wasn't necessarily the intention. However, cleaning out my colon was the intention. And honey, I lost six pounds of waste. Okay, so uh, this detox is mainly going to be contributing to a flush. It's going to help you drop more of the bloating, water weight, and flush out all of the lingering food that's been in your colon. So let me say the price of this was, I want to say $36. It's a one day cleanse, one bottle. Um, you only need one bottle. They do say though, you, if you don't um, go to the bathroom at least two or three times within the 24 hours, they recommend you taking another bottle. So that's something to know. I wasn't aware until I got mine and read it myself. Uh, the taste is just fucking disgusting. I'm going to be honest with you. I'll insert the clip where you will see what I'm going through. It just has like more than a herbal taste. It just has like this really unique, indescribable taste. I'm not gonna lie. I used lemon to cut mine. It helped, but not really. Um, so just prepare yourself for that. Hey family. Okay, so um, I'm really excited about this. I've been waiting a while to take this cleanse. I um, wanted to make sure I have a full weekend where I can stay home and I have busy weekends. So this weekend just happened to be the perfect one because I have nothing to go out and do. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this. Um, for those of you who want to see the ingredient list, feel free to pause. Um, we have water, moringa, dandelion, king of the forest, um, soursop leaves, guinea hen, Janka bush, leaf of life, aloe vera, prickly pear, garlic, star of anise, and cinnamon. Very simple, all things I can pronounce. So yeah, definitely here for that. It is a one day cleanse. Um, you drink the whole thing. They say the period is 24 hours. We'll see. I've heard some other people say that their cleanse lasted um, up to 48, 72 hours of pooping, um, right? Getting rid of waste. So it's supposed to help reduce bloating, alleviate stomach aches, constipation, encourage better sleep, increase energy levels, flush out your colon, lung, liver, and kidneys, um, help your immune system, and improve bowel movements. So yeah, I'm going to be taking this. They say you're not supposed to dilute this. This is a herbal tea technically, um, but I'm going to be doing a little bit of ice because I heard it tastes better cold. I heard it doesn't taste good at all. Y'all about to see that and just some lemon. I'm gonna squeeze a little bit of lemon inside and then have a little lemon chaser just in case. So let's go ahead and get into this. Let me see if I can prop you guys up. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into this. I don't even know what it 
smells like. I'm a little nervous, honestly, just because the reviews say it really is not a pleasant taste. Um, again, coming from a long line of Creek medicine women um, in the South, I know a lot of the herbal remedies don't taste good, so I'm not turned off by that. Bitter is better. So the smell is very herbal. It doesn't smell too bad though. So let's see. I did shake it. It looks like a tea. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's not smelling good, y'all. It's not. I'm gonna go ahead and squeeze some lemon in. Try not to get the seeds. I'm hearing a little bubble. Oh, got a seed in there. Oh, well. Okay. Let's do it. A lot of people say try to just drink it all in one go. I'm going to... I'm just going to drink as much as I can immediately before I really know what it tastes like. And I'll tell you guys. Okay. Ooh. 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 It does not taste good. Ooh, that tastes really... Danky. I'm scared to drink more. <sighs> Ooh. It's not for the weak stomach, the weak of heart. Woo! My intention was to show you guys me drinking this whole drink. So I'm gonna try to get it down without making this too long, but I will say you definitely wanna have some lemon or something. Woo! Wow. Okay. I'm scared to go back. This is almost like different than um tequila. Try to put the straw as far back your throat as possible. Whew. I'm fighting my gag reflex right now. Now, I got this before the new formula came out. They have a new formula. It's supposed to have the same detoxing abilities and taste better. I'd be interested to see what that tastes like. Mm. Mm. This lemon will save your life, trust me. Okay, so. We got it down. This morning I haven't ate anything, I fasted. I did have some coffee, because I'm a coffee drinker. Um, it's 8, 11 a.m. So I'll be back with the first bowel movement and kind of just update y'all throughout the day. See how long it's gonna take to start working. All right, let's go. Peace. They do have a new formula that's supposed to be a little bit more um, better tasting. I haven't had that one. So if you do decide to go and get it, uh, be sure to look out for the new and improved flavor. So yeah, this 
uh, product claims that it reduces bloating, encourages, encourages better sleep, increases energy levels, encourages bowel movements, and alleviates constipation and stomach ache and bloating. So from my experience, I'd say majority of these claims, I felt almost literally the next day immediately. Um, within the first few hours, I definitely saw the bloating going down. I can't say it increased my sleep because I already have a hard time sleeping. Um, I am a night person, but my lifestyle doesn't necessarily uh, click with that because I work in the office. I work, you know, in human services as a someone who shows up for the community. You have to be there during office hours. That's just what it is. However, I will say that I did have very, very regular and easy bowel movements both during this cleanse and even after. I was actually so excited. I um, told my partner like, oh my god, I'm like my poop, it's pooping so, I'm pooping so well. Like I feel so cleaned out. So that I appreciate. Um, I didn't necessarily have constipation at the time, so there weren't any aches or anything that were alleviated, but I can say I definitely wasn't constipated. The meals that I were eating were coming through me within a timely manner, so I do appreciate that. One thing that I really want to let you guys know, I wish somebody would have told me, this obviously will have you on the toilet like every 30 to 60 minutes, but after you've eliminated the first maybe three or four hours, you're gonna feel very, very, very tired. I found myself needing to like lay on the couch and really relax. Um, I found myself feeling almost a little bit exhausted from shitting so much, but also from like everything being stripped out of me. So you will feel this go through your body and really clean you out more than just the, the, the stomach. Like I feel like my actual physical organs and things must have been triggered to detox because um, my energy, I was just so tired. I just wanted to lay down. My body felt very sensitive. Okay, y'all. So quick update. Um, it is now 12, 15 p.m. So it's been about four hours since I took the drink. Clearly, I'm laid out right now in my living room. I thought I was going to be able to just move on with my regular day, do my regular stuff, you know, pick up the house, this, that, or whatever. Every step I take, my stomach is like, you can feel it moving inside of you. It's kind of crazy. Um, how fast did it work? Very fast. Within the first hour, I've been keeping track. I want to say 9, uh, 15, 9, 10, I was using the bathroom. I thought I had to pass a little gas, um, but I knew not to play myself. So I said, let me not just pass this gas, thinking it's gas. Um, I went to the bathroom and it definitely was not gas. It was not gas. So um, that was the first time. Then I want to say again around 10, 10 a.m., another explosive stream of purging um that's when i realized this was this this was gonna be no joke this was yeah um again i think i don't even think i made it another hour i want to say like 10 i have notes on my phone but i can't record and pull the notes up at the same time so around 10 50 a.m i went to the bathroom again um it's weird because you kind of smell the smell of the tea like maybe the herbs just the potency the potency of the herbs moving through you it doesn't really it's not a good reminder of like what it tasted like like it's just it's 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 an experience we'll say that um and then again i just went to the bathroom um uh, maybe like 12 Oh, for something 10 15 minutes ago um it's it's moving it's definitely moving through me i feel i don't feel weak or anything um but i do feel very like sensitive so um just like moving around too much make one move laugh too loud <laughs> it's it's dangerous so definitely don't want to do this and be going out or have any place you need to be let me tell you right now I will say positively, um, I do feel like bloating has gone down. Um, probably going to hop in the shower soon just because I've been doing so much eliminating. I'm just like, ugh. Um, 
but yeah so far so good so um i will let you guys know within the 24 hour mark how much weight i've lost how much uh, waste i needed to eliminate from my body um so yeah that's how i was going i am out of commission for sure you want to make sure you drink a lot of water. Now it does say this on here, stay hydrated. I would recommend that you already have like a big gallon of water ready to go, whether you have lemons in it, cucumbers, something super hydrating inside of it. And you want to be drinking a lot of water before you take this, during and after, because I made the mistake, I was drinking water when I took the detox, but I wanna say like the day after or so, I didn't drink as much as I took, um, with this and I felt so thirsty, so dehydrated. I could tell I wasn't putting enough water in me to flush that stuff out of my system. So as with any detox, you wanna make sure that you're giving yourself enough water to actually release the toxins and things out of your organs, okay? Um, the ingredient list on this is very natural, so that's something that you can appreciate. Everything on here you can pronounce, well, for the most part, I could pronounce. Um, it has a lot of just natural leaves natural fruits natural ingredients of course water and it tastes like it too it tastes like it too so the main two oh let's say three the main three things i would definitely recommend with this is that you a drink it cold maybe pop it in the freezer before you drink it or maybe put a couple um ice cubes in your cup again i'll insert the video because i feel like having it cold helped me drink it down faster if this was warm i i don't think i could have got it down because the smell with the warmth just would have been too much however i would recommend you don't mix this with any juice or anything like that you don't want to mess up the the recipe or the potency but you do want to um try to drink it down as fast as you can i recommend using a straw i saw a lot of people online mention that a straw helps you get it as far back your throat as possible which is what i did and i appreciate that tip so if you're listening take that tip use a straw and two don't plan to go anywhere that day maybe not even the next day you definitely want to do this where you have two days consecutively off where you're able to take advantage of that uh, and also during the day that you're taking the detox, I wouldn't necessarily plan any super um, strenuous activities at home. For example, I thought I was going to be able to do my regular weekend cleaning, you know, deep cleaning the kitchen and just going through and doing all this stuff. No. Uh-uh. Two things. One, no energy. Okay. And two, Every little move you make, you feel like you need to go to the bathroom. Like if I would just get up off of the couch and like, for example, play with my cat or the dog, right? I would feel like, ooh, like literally clench your cheeks, honey, because this thing is gonna be moving through you. So keep that in mind when you do your detox. Um, I did weigh in on the scale. And like I said, lost six pounds of waste within that 24 hour period. I would say I started this, at 8 a.m which you'll see in the video but the last time that i got up like in an irregular need to use the bathroom was probably around two or three o'clock in the morning um the next day and then after that the next morning it was pretty normal it wasn't like i was continuing to go to the bathroom i did go to the bathroom fre frequently that day because my bowel movement seemed to be clear everything was running through me easily um not like liquidy like the detox but more so just like very consistent and easy so <sighs> is there anything else i'm missing with this i know we've talked a lot about a lot of things <laughs> we've been talking for a long time but um i feel like there's something i'm missing that i want to bring up oh i personally would recommend that you try to eat like whole food diet fruits vegetables healthy proteins fats eat eat healthy the day before the day of and a couple days after why okay why because the way this moves through you honey i'm trying to, I, I cannot explain <laughs> i cannot explain with words truly the way that this detox moves through you and not just your stomach and your colon like i said like detoxing other organs within your body you feel this and so the least work 
that this has to do, the better you will probably feel. So I would recommend that you try to eat clean a couple of days before you intend to take this. Definitely the day of, try to eat light, you know, smoothies, maybe some meat, salad, little things like that. Um, I personally didn't feel like eating very much when I was when I was detoxing on this. Um, but the day after, again, you want to try to eat clean, eat light so that it can continue detoxing and flushing out everything without having to work extra hard. So that was the last thing I definitely wanted to recommend for you guys. But yeah, I definitely would see myself doing this again. This cleanse is supposed to be taken or the most it can be taken, I should say, is once every 30 days. Now, I personally would not put myself through this every 30 days. Ain't no way. Just between the taste and like literally having a whole two-day recovery period, I would probably take this quarterly. That's just me. Now, if you're someone who, um, you know, detoxes regularly and maybe you can handle a more regular gentle detox, then do you every 30 days, boo get that waste out of you that's cool maybe some people might do this twice a year after the holidays what, what however it fits in your lifestyle it's pretty flexible um i will say the more you buy the more of a discount you do get on this so if you guys are interested i'll go ahead and i'll put the um obviously the information for where you can find the cleanse in there but there is actually a discount code that they provided me it is not a sponsored video let me let me say that this video is not sponsored i pay my coins for this honey i paid my coins for this and if i buy it again i would have to pay my coins for it again however they did offer a i want to say 10 or 15 percent off um, little code now I don't know how long it's gonna last I don't know if it's just for me or if it's for everybody I don't know but if you want it hit me in the comments of this video ask me let me know I'll go ahead and send out the um the coupon code or whatever put it in the description or whatever the case may be but yeah that's everything so all in all i definitely would recommend this detox again now there are a lot of other teas and things out there and i do still have some other things that i would use more on like a regular basis that are a little bit more gentle shorter purging period but if i want a deep cleanse or if i have something going on that i really need to just get a nice you know flush i would totally use this again again peculiar people holistic happy colon cleanser and that's it okay all right we did it so family if you made it this far i really appreciate you please consider liking this video it does help spotlight our collective it is very helpful for me i love you so much do you hear me i love you okay and i am hoping this journey continues to treat you with so much grace i hope that you are honoring yourself i hope that you are taking the time to do the things that you enjoy now and always okay and i will see you all in the next video all right next time peace